Me and Donut Operator just hosted the biggest creator range day of all time. We invited YouTubers, streamers, pro fighters, meme lords, my son, to a private range day hosted at Demolition Ranch's brand new range. I brought out a ton of my personal machine guns, sponsors brought some of their own guns, and between me, Donut, and Demo, we put on the biggest creator range day ever. So somebody's landing in a helicopter, and I don't know if we have a landing site for that or not. I think we're about to figure the fuck I think out, it's though. The president. I hope not. They circled like several times. They didn't know where they were, so uh, I assume it's him. Nope. We're just going to keep to the core rules of gun safety. Treat every gun here like it's loaded, because most of them are. Know your target and what's behind it. In that case, that means keep everything on the berm. Nothing goes over the berm. Keep your finger off the trigger until you're ready to shoot. That means gun is loaded and on target. And never point your weapon at anything you're not willing to destroy, which hopefully includes other people. If you guys stick to those four rules, everybody's going to have a good time and leave with as many holes as they came with. Welcome right to Demolition Ranch. Sure, fuck it. I'll shoot one right now. This thing's stupid. Christ alive. <laughs> Three inch slug, Jesus. Best 120 bucks I ever spent. <laughs> Hello. I'm gonna come. Oh my god. I already did. Yeah, was that you firing the AK? Uh, that was Dog Matt. Rails? Oh, okay, gotcha. Yeah. <laughs> I shot that abomination of a gold shotgun. That's a big turnout, man. Dude, we didn't expect it to be this fucking big, but we have a lot of cool people helping us out, so... As long as everybody leaves unshot, I'll be happy. Hey, yeah, that's the goal, man. A little shrapnel's fine. How many years have you been doing this? A bit of shrapnel. This is our first real year doing this. Okay. Like, we did one creator range day last year, like kind of a bigger one, but it was fucking nothing like this. Real quick shout out to just all the amazing sponsors who came out to help make this thing possible. You guys were awesome, and the people who came out loved demoing some of the product you brought. Fucking rad. I would love one. We were talking about it the other day. I'm like, oh yeah, cool. It's like, uh, it's all the, the good of the mutant without uh, having the gay AR charging or the uh, buffer tube. It's even more again, though. Yeah. That's fucking cool, man. The recoil impulse on it's so much different than it is, isn't it? It's different. I'm not even saying it's like better or worse. It's just different. Right. Are you in debt? I know I am. <laughs> Greetings from the road touring District 23 right now. As you can imagine, a lot of those guns, machine guns, ammo, vehicles, everything that we're out doing on the range, it can come at quite a price tag. You might have a different reason you're in debt. Credit cards, student loans, in today's economy, there's a lot of reasons you could have a little bit of debt you need to get rid of. Medical bills, personal loans, whatever. And if you're wondering if there's a better way to pay off that debt, that's where PDS Debt Solutions comes in. With rising interest rates and the cost of living at an all-time high, maybe now's the time to take initiative over getting your debt under control. So if you're making payments every month and your balance still isn't going down, maybe this is for you. PDS Debt rolls all of your payments into one low monthly payment, which can help you pay for your debts in a fraction of the time while also saving on interest and fees. The best part is anyone with over $10,000 in eligible debt is qualified and there's no minimum credit score required. PDS will also give you a free debt savings analysis just for completing the 30 second online debt assessment at pdsdebt.com slash bh. You'll receive a full breakdown on how to save on interest every month and the fastest way to take care of your debt. So go ahead and check them out using the links down in the description and in the pinned comment and again that is pdsdebt slash bh. Now back to the content. He said it kicks like a shotgun? It kicks like a shotgun, yeah. I've got okay. a five inch mortar in there. Okay. The pistol is up. There you go. Firing! Three, two, one! Oh god! That's kinda dope. That's kinda fucking dope. How you doing? Dude, fucking can't well. complain. The this turnout's been great. Yeah, fucking clearly, dude. This must have been the biggest amount of like admin you guys have ever had to go through. Here. We've had a Get really good these. team. Really? Yeah, we. I we... see you guys. Is that the is that a number for um for uh, like health shit, like for a hospital? 
No, no, so that's uh, one of the guys. It's a rich guy. Oh, yeah. Okay. So I was like, yeah, it's either like a medical thing or it's a rich dude. It's either one of the two. <laughs> Sir? I was trying to go for your pistol. Uh, I know, that's why I kind of did that. <laughs> you know, dude. You he know. reached for the officer's surface you know. weapon. What are you doing? Well, I'm working up the courage to go for one of the cop's handguns. Mm -hmm. uh, Wait until they look really exhausted at yeah, the end of the day tired. and then just. Yeah. I know how to. <laughs> like a what? fucking Beyblade. Yeah. Game over. Game over. What's up, buddy? How are you? Sorry, we bump swordens. No, okay. Did our swordens just touch? Yeah, they just uh, rubbed a little bit. Holy crap, the turnout is huge. Evan? Yeah. I gave uh, donut operators mom. Oh, you need to. What's up, boss? How are you doing, man? Good to meet you. Good to meet you, brother. Thank you for inviting me. Absolutely, man. This is awesome. This is kind of fucking, it's bigger than we thought it was going to be. Yeah. A lot of people came. I didn't know there'd be food trucks and vendors. My Uber driver dropped me off like a half mile left. He's like, I'm not going any further. And so then, like, I, I was like, I got out and went to a little tent, like an awkward idiot. I was like, just stopped a guy in a white van. With, uh, Ballistics Labs, I think. Oh, yeah. That yeah. Guy. Ordnance Labs. Ordnance Labs. And I was like, hey, can I, can I ride with you? He was like, get on in. So, <laughs> Sean's a psychopath, if that makes Ordnance sense. Labs. Yeah, do you need them? Yeah, do you have like big ones? Yeah. Are these better than these? Uh, you can try. Yeah, yeah, they are. Yeah. Yeah. Those are kind of dookie. I was drunk last night and oh, I was no. talking about my childhood dream that I've always wanted to punch a congressman in the face. And then I was like, oh, you wait, can do that. wait, this could happen. My dream could come true, but we got, you know. Hey, Jack, how you doing? Oh, God. The you has nothing to do with anything. I just, I, this has been going on for 30 years now. You're like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm I just sorry, needed to. Sorry. You're the first one I had access to. <laughs> What's up, buddy? Good to see you, man. Oh, sorry. Our ears just bumped. That was kind of, you know. Oh, you know, that means we're, we got to get in Hey, Mr. Kennedy, sir. How are you? I'm amazing. This is fucking you know insanity. I mean, you know Dude, I am. Um, well, we, we got three hours. I was really just raging at them. I was like, what the fuck is going on? Like, I just came to say, hey, and how can I support you guys? And well, now I'm like, fuck, I'm overwhelmed. I'm going to leave. Yeah, it's kind of been, it's been a lot of peopling. But we still have four hours for people to shoot somebody. So, like, don't say that. Don't, you know. um, don't put that. I, I, I rebuke those words. <laughs> Listen to me, Jesus. No. I got a gun wall almost as cool as yours. I'm working on it, so. Yeah, well, everybody has to start somewhere, you know? I don't have an SOT, so I hope. I'm just collector. And... Oh, well, that's fucking more impressive then. Yeah. yeah. That's, uh, I hope you surpass me one day. Hi, guys. Savvy here. We're here with uh, our future Mr. President. <laughs> the fuck are you talking about? Congressman. Brandon Herrera. Brandon Herrera. If you could make out with any male here, who would it be and why is it Eli? Oh, it already is Eli. I knew it. It's been Eli. It's always been Eli. It's also win. like, he yeah. just, he feels like he'd be a good little spoon as well. So dude, what the fuck is this? So it's a 50 cal plasma pump, I call it. It's electrically ignited, a solenoid locking mechanism. So the, the pump trigger here unlocks it. This uh, solenoid is basically just a locking bar. Probably a little bit more of a sophisticated firing setup than my, uh, my pipe gun. Just a little bit, although I have heard rumors that the Shinzo Abe guy uh, stole my design because really he, he was. Oh, I did actually hear that. He was using um, he was basically using a bridge wire, which is my original designs used a bridge wire with black powder. But yeah, Japanese uh, Japanese media at least blamed me. So, oops, that's worth something. Yeah, <laughs> straight malfunction, straight malfunction. That's straight up the hottest <laughs> dude I've ever seen. Oh, you're recording that? Delete that. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Sam? Good yeah. to finally meet you, man. What's up, man? How are you? How you doing? Doing great, man. Doing good. Awesome. Dude, thanks for coming out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> what? What's going on right now? How are you? I believe you. <laughs> Uh, for our grand finale, World of Warships donated a nice H1 Humvee for us to, well, destroy. Hey, ceasefire will be on a siren. His horn doesn't work. Police siren. So I think we're about to do a mad minute on a perfectly functional Humvee. Kind of sad about that, but hey, they wanted to shoot it, so. 
It's their Humvee. It's their, their Humvee, their rules. Thank you. So that was awesome. Thank you so much to the creators who came out. Hopefully you guys had a good time. Thank you to the RSOs for making sure that everybody was safe. Nobody got injured. I know, crazy, right? A line full of machine guns, ammo, helicopters, explosions, and you know, somehow everybody's able to be safe. It's, it's kind of wild. It's like as long as you're safe, nothing bad happens. Weird thought. Huge shout out again to the sponsors. This was an expensive thing to put on just from the amount of manpower, the guns, the ammunition. God, it was a lot of ammunition. You guys were awesome and you helped make this happen. I'm looking forward to seeing you guys back when we do this again. Speaking of doing this again, let me know down in the comments other creators you'd like to have out. Influencers, celebrities, whoever you can think of. Because the real objective of these events is obviously to have a good time and to make sure everybody else has a good time. But it's to take people who have an audience, who have a following from other walks of life, not just in the gun industry, and showing them and showing their audience that you can be safe with guns. There's safe ways to enjoy guns and they're not as scary as people think. Spreading the gospel of the Second Amendment, so to speak, in a safe, healthy, and fun way. And now I appreciate you guys staying all the way to the end of the video. And I will see you sexy YouTube mother lovers. Probably from the next video I have to make still on the campaign trail. Thanks, guys. I don't know where I'm walking. This is a hotel room. They just turn the blades and just start killing all of us. Just like, <laughs> blah, blah, blah. <laughs> like GTA. Just, that I'm looks already, terrifying. I've already got one next scar. I really don't want another one today. Just, uh... <laughs> That was still one of my favorite bits from that fucking, uh, I saw the edit before uh, you guys put it out. The, no, Matt, you don't have the neck meat. <laughs> yeah. Hey, look at we my pocket crack, today, though. Crack I'm like, just in case, they can't put it around your neck, though. So. Yeah. Well, they can, they can for like it'll, 12 seconds. It'll stop the pain a lot quicker. <laughs> it will. Yeah, you know what? As a, as a painkiller tool, it's pretty good. <laughs> it makes the bad head movies go away. <laughs>